fluffy horses. Look at how big this cave is. You know what would sound great in here, Leo? Please don't be a song. Please don't be a song. A song! <sighs> On an adventure with Leo in some kind of cave. But this isn't a normal cave, Bubbles. It's the entrance to the Hall of the Mountain Moles. That's what Nova told us, at least. On an adventure with Leo in a super special cave. <laughs> Find a new star keeper. We gotta be really brave. Ah! <laughs> yep, way to be brave, Bubbles. They just surprised me. Besides, I think bats are actually super cute. Ah, those big eyes and those little faces. <laughs> I wanna squeal. Ah, they're just so adorable. Yuck, bats are not cute. You know, this cave is so dark and gloomy, it makes me think we might not have a very warm welcome when we reach the mountain moles. It is gloomy in here, but all it needs is a good dusting and maybe some sunshine. <gasps> and colors! <gasps> if we painted the cave walls yellow and purple and green, it would be a lot happier in here. Man, I wish I'd brought the stuffed animals from my bed. They'd really make this place cozy. I take it back. This cave is just fine how it is. Looks like we're here. Whoa. Look at how big that door is. It's huge. huge, huge, huge. <gasps> Let's knock. Hello, mountain moles. Mole, mole, mole. Everybody home? Shh. Bubbles, stop that. What? They're not dangerous, probably. I'm sure they're so nice and welcoming. You should have more faith in people, Leo. Besides, our next starkeeper is supposed to be in here. Not everyone is as nice as you think they are. There could be a bunch of enemies waiting on the other side of that door. <sighs> Get ready. <laughs> Hello, do do. Ah! I hope you know what you're doing. There could be a ferocious cave monster. Or a bunch of cave spiders, or... <laughs> Welcome to the Great Hall of the Mountain Moles, travelers! Come in, come in! That cave is damp and drafty, but it's nice and warm in here! Um... Thank you! so much for inviting us in. Your underground city is so pretty. <gasps> Look at all the lights. Oh, I'm Bubbles, and this is Leo. Well, welcome, Bubbles and Leo. I am Chief Pannon, the leader of the Mountain Moles. Everyone, we have guests. Please make Bubbles and Leo feel welcome. <laughs> I don't know about you, Leo, but I'm not seeing any giant cave spiders. Yeah, yeah, just don't forget the mission. We're here to find the next Starkeeper, not be all holly jolly with the moles. Chief Thannon, we need you to approve the plan for the festivities. <gasps> festivities? What are you celebrating? Why, you'll miss, of course. It's our gift giving season. It only comes once a year, and we always throw a huge celebration. Oh, I need to go help with the planning, but I'll leave you in good hands. Tank! Where are you, son? I'm, uh, I'm right here, Dad. Oh, perfect! Come over here and meet our guests. No need to be shy. Uh, this is my son, Tank. He's the best at everything he sets his mind to, so he's the perfect person to take care of you and give you the full tour. Uh, Dad, please, you know I'm not a... Nonsense, my boy! You are wonderful. Leo, Bubbles, I hope you'll consider staying for the festivities. No, we won't be able to... We'd love to! <laughs> so nice of them to invite us. I'd love to see what a Yulmus is like. Bubbles, we can't forget about the mission. Hey, 
I want the mission to succeed as much as anyone, but we can do the mission while also celebrating Yulemus with our new friends. Um... Uh. Celebrating isn't going to find our next Starkeeper for us. Well, being rude isn't going to find them either. Excuse me, uh, new guests? Oh no, we haven't even met our new guide. <gasps> Look at that! You've already made me be rude. I would like you to apologize. Oh, that's really not... Apologize? Uh... For what? Doing my job? Is it your job to be the Emperor of Rude? The King of Cruel? The Sultan of Selfish? Uh, he really wasn't that... Okay, seriously. How long have you been working on those names? I was not working on them for very long. What was that? That was the ancient worm of the abyss. Uh, we call her Queen Tremor. They say she's the size of a mountain. You, you don't need to worry, though. The shakes are normal. They've been happening a lot more often lately, but I'm sure it's nothing. Anyway, uh, I'm Tank. Would you guys still like that tour? I'm not sure I'm the best guy to show you around, but if my dad thinks I can do it, I'll try my best. A tour would be super duper rainbows! <laughs> Sorry for arguing earlier. We can get a little carried away. Don't worry about it. Um, so, Tank, I don't mean to be rude, but... You don't look anything like your dad. Leo! No, no, it's okay. I mean, you look a little bit like him, but you have this... Shell? Yeah, it's a shell. You see, I'm not actually a mountain mole. I'm an armadillion. I'm adopted. Armadillos? We have those on my planet. Oh, I see. Well, anyone can see that you're dad. Hey, Tink. Good to see you. And your people really love you. Your dad must believe in you a lot to put you in charge of us. One of us isn't easy to handle. Yeah, I'll say. That's nice of you to say, but... Uh, I don't know about all that. Anyway, come on, let me give you the tour. Wow, now this, this is a cave. Look at all those gems. <gasps> Rubies and emeralds and sapphires. Oh, they are so sparkly. I love glitter and sparkles, and wow, this is like a dream come true. Wow, wow, wow! With all these gems, there must be plenty to choose from to give his gifts during Yulmus. Well, the only gem my dad wants is the red diamond. It's this huge, legendary diamond that's said to be more red than any ruby. Dad's been searching for it for years, but no one's ever been able to find it. That sounds cool. So you guys are all miners? I mean, uh, most of us are. Most of you? I'm not much of a miner. I can barely hold a pickaxe with these claws, and I'm definitely not strong enough to throw rocks around like they can. I mean, I'm not really a mountain mole after all. Don't say that. Didn't you hear your dad earlier? He said you were able to do anything you put your mind to. You may not look like the other mountain moles, but that doesn't mean you can't do things just as well as they can. Nah, I could never be as good as a mountain mole. They're strong and tough and not afraid of anything. All I know how to do is curl up into a ball inside my shell and hide. That's not true. Tank, your dad believes in you, and he knows you better than anyone. You can trust him. I'm sure he's got great plans to use your talents to help all the mountain moles. It's nice of you to say so, but I think... <laughs> Well, look at that. He wasn't kidding. He really can't curl up into a ball. Whoa. This shake is going on for a really long time. This is so not sparkles and glitter. You can say that again. The whole village must be feeling this. But, Tank, what should we do? Hello? Tank? We can't understand you when you're inside your shell. <sighs> Sorry about that. I, I got a little spooked. <laughs> oh no. We need to go help them. Tank, lead the way. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh. What happened? The earthquake was too strong and the cave collapsed. Chief Thannon is trapped back there. Oh no, Dad! We need to get him out. I don't think any fire or water would help. I don't think so either. Fire would just make it hotter in this cave. And water would just fill it up. Not very helpful. Gosh darn it, I hate not being helpful. Oh, this rock is diamidium. It's very strong. If we just use our pickaxes, it will take a very long time to break through. And who knows what could happen if there's another shake. That earthquake must have been really strong if it broke through the diamidium. How are we going to get my dad out? If only I was good at mining, I could help. Your dad said you are good at mining, Tank. I'm sure if he thinks you can do it, then you can. Can anyone out there hear me? Is everyone okay? We hear you, Chief. We're going to find a way to get you out of there. <laughs> I'm sure you will. I know Tank can get us out. Listen, we need a plan. If we can't use fire or water, I'm not sure how we can get him out. And if your pickaxes can't break through... There has to be a way we can help him. Tank, what do you think we should do? Well, at least Dad is safe for now, so we have some time to come up with a plan. Uh, uh, no, 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 no! This place is going to cave in even more! We don't have long! We need to tunnel around. We should all try together to pull the rocks out of the way. I may not be strong or brave, but if my dad thinks I can do this, then I'm going to try. I may not be the best miner, but I'm coming to get you, Dad! Leo, is that... The portal gaster. It's reacting to Tank. Tank, quick, take this and put it on. What? Why? It'll give you power. Just put it on. Starkeeper detected. Power up initiated. What is happening? I'm growing. Yay! Whoa, he's huge and strong. Is that rock armor? Wow! It's like he has a rock shell around his entire body now. You're right! And I am strong! I bet I can lift this boulder trapping my dad! Everybody step back! Come on, Tank! I believe in you! Great things, Tank. After all, I know you better than anyone. <sighs> Thanks, Dad. I think maybe we should get back to the main cave. Yeah, I don't really want to be flattened by diamidium. Sir, the quakes are getting worse. If this continues, we'll have to cancel the Yulmas celebrations. Oh, nonsense! The cave was just weak. Queen Tremor is always active this time of year. We'll just have to trust that she'll calm down like she usually does. The festivities must go on. But it's even worse than usual. More caves are collapsing and... Never happened before. Oh, this is bad. <clears throat> My people, I'm afraid we may have to. <sighs> we may have to cancel Yulmus. 